Yeah, so we're headed over to Zhao Ha Water Park. Stay tuned for that. All right, guys, so we are finally inside the actual Zhao Ha. We got one of these. This pass to get in, $90. Sunscreen, $15. Rash guard, $45. Shoes, $25. Whoa, there's a dolphin. Let's go. We're gonna go in the lagoon. And they also provide food, drink, life vest, snorkel. Look at that big old water slide right there. With these like beaches with sand. Coconut trees everywhere. Look at that. That's kind of cool. See what that says? Hidden World by Eshkaret, Zaha. Nice. Wonderful. We're gonna go across that uh, floating bridge over there. Let's do it. See the sand, sandbar. Oh, they get a stingray. A couple stingrays. Oh man, let's try out this floating bridge here. Oh, this is real interesting. Ooh. So it got quite breezy as we were walking across this floating bridge here, but what I was basically saying was to the left of the bridge, the water is choppy with white caps, and then as it passes underneath the bridge, it calms down as it comes into the aquatic park. You can see the water on the right side is much calmer than on the left side where the actual Caribbean Sea is. the uh, way here they got a cenotes over here Cueva Mile okay this little jungle walk over here to the cenotes check out these new shoes so much better than flip-flops because they can do two things go in water and walk on land flip-flops can only go on land unless you want to wash away Plus, these won't hurt your feet with blisters or anything. When you get a new pair of flip-flops, they can blister your feet. Okay, right here. Whoa, it's stinky down here a little bit. What is going on down here? Okay. A little bit eerie. It's not too stinky, but a little musty. Maybe those ring-tailed cats are down here. Manatees are over here. Oh, it's like a swamp up in here in the back end of this park. Pretty cool. Okay, what have we got here? No swimming. No nadar. Okay. Whoa. No swimming. It's 
Probably because people would do some crazy things in there. Like pee. They do have people swimming in this and up to here. The algae. You can swim there, but you can't swim here. Gosh, that is amazing. Could you imagine being a Maya? I'd want to live here if I was Maya. The grotto? What is this? Oh, no. I see. Cool. <laughs> Shell Grotto. Ah, they do have a porcupine here. Cool thing about the way they built this park was like they left the plants instead of pulling them out, they just like built around it, right? It's so, like the path still has trees in the middle of it. Good idea. As you can see, there's this uh, bike zip line these guys are taken here and uh, it's $35 extra Oh wow, what do we got? What do we got here? It's a uh, jungle river. They say there's no rivers, but whatever this is, underground river. Oh, it leads out to the ocean. Yeah, it leads out to the ocean. Rio Snorkel, Snorkel River. Inner tube river. Do you imagine showing up here? before they started developing it. Right on in there. Mangroves, where the manatees like to live. Yeah, as you can see here, we've got some manatees, also known as sea cows. They like to hang out in the back end of the park here in the mangroves. But they can really end up anywhere in the park because they have free range.
Is this from the camera? See? Sí. Camera. Whoa. Right into the water you go. This little thing for the kids. It's like a little adventure escape through the uh, jungle. You can walk through here. As I mentioned earlier, the buffet is included. Drinks, food. Yeah, so that's most of the Jalha water park. If I was to compare this to the Explore or Eshkoret main park, I would say that the Eshkoret main park is more of a historical experience and also the water park. So I would say Bio Park is all Eshal, no history. So I would take Eshkoret as the all-in-one park. If you guys really want the uh, outdoor adventure adrenaline rush that's explore so uh again the x is pronounced like an esh that's why we say it that way anyways hope you guys enjoyed this and we'll see you on the next one mm -hmm.